Creative Peeps and welcome back to my channel. Today I have an unboxing to share with you. It's been a while since I have done one of these. I purchased a drunk trunk kit from I'm a cool mom, not drunk. Did I say drunk? Junk trunk kit. Can't can't say words today. Um <laughs> from Jessica over at I'm a cool mom. As I'm filming this, there are some left. Um, but I guess you'll just have to check and see for yourself. So I'm opening it upside down so you don't see anybody's address. But for those of you that don't know, this is a junk journaling kit. Um, I purchased this with my own money. This isn't like a paid review or anything. Um, but I just wanted to share with you what's in here and my plans for what to do with it. Um, cause I like, yeah, you know, why not? So you get uh, links to a video course that come with this kit, which is what's inside here. I believe there's a couple printables too. There is a different, um, she calls it the drunk, drunk, junk, trunk crew. <laughs> uh, it's like her design team and she picks different people every month. And My Life Mitts is actually on it this month. So I'm really excited to see what Mitts does with her uh, kit. And I'll have to check out some of the other people she's listed because I don't recognize anybody else's name really. So we're just going to go over what's in here real quick. Um, she did a like traveler's notebook themed one this uh, month. So you get this piece of faux leather. Um, it is faux. And I'm going, I have an idea of what I want to do with it, but I don't know if the piece will be big enough to. I kind of want to make like a folio or try to anyway. I don't have a sewing machine, so it'll be a little uh, challenging, but we'll see what I can do with that. Um, there were different leathers and different fabrics that you could get, so I'm really happy that I got this teal fabric because I think out of all the ones she showed, this is the one that I actually liked. Um, so I'm really happy about that. So it's made to line this, I think, but we'll see what I do with it. I thought you only got one piece of leather, but it looks like there's two. So I don't know if that was a packaging mistake on her part or not. Um, or if I was just wrong about what it came with. But that's pretty sweet. Um, I know she had ordered some extra. So I don't know if she threw extra in here. So it also comes with these pages. It was like a retro three theme this um month and I these aren't quite my style but I think they're cute and I know that some other ladies would love them so I'm going to make a traveler's notebook insert using these and papers I like to use um, and probably either give it away or sell it on Etsy so that'll be a fun project let's see I really wanted to try some silk sorry ribbon I believe that's what this is um, so this is another good way to sample um, things so it's from the Victorian Gypsy Girl on Etsy. So if I like it, I know where to get more, which is cool. So in here, uh, there's a bag of lace, the elastic to make a traveler's notebook, and some binding thread, I believe. Um, of course, I'll use the elastic for something else um, if I don't make a traveler's notebook. But again, it's cool that she includes that for you. And I'll end up using the pink lace and stuff on somebody's um, journal. This is her bead kit to make a charm, um, which is really cool. And she includes the little class for you, which is awesome that she uses. I actually made one inspired by her with the class, so I'm excited to give a crack at it again. Let's see. <laughs> you also get a stack of papers. I've been wanting to try this letter paper here, so there's that. Some vintage book pages. Um, which I have a ton of, but it's always fun to get some more. Some cool uh, recipe pages that would go with the Traveler's Notebook. And then it looks like she's coffee dyed some pages, so it's going to be fun to uh, put those in a journal and try those out. Those are really nicely coffee dyed. Um, and this one's kind of pinky, which is cool. They're a little stuck together, but so goes the coffee dyeing game, right? Hopefully you can hear me over me like, you know. She gives you one of these envelope, class envelopes, which I like using, so that's pretty cool. 
And in this bag here are ephemera bits. We have some green stars, some Pictionary game pieces, a bingo, bingo ephemera, more stars, a message pad. I have wanted one of these layaway tags forever. I'm going to hoard this like nobody's business. And some guest checks, which are cool. I've also been wanting to take a crack at some guest checks for a long time. Um, I bought some, but they were like super like cheap like paper. Um, and these are thicker, which is what I wanted. So I'm excited to try that out. And you get a glassine bag, which is cool. So if you were making an actual like complete journal with using only this kit, you'd be pretty well set um, to do so. All right, so then she had some guest people. Um, there is Amora Fabrics. So it looks like some fabric samples, a couple buttons, and a vintage book page. Um, so that's cool. That'll go with the Traveler's Notebook that I make with the papers. And then this is from Above Park Crafts. And you get a little, um, just some little ephemera cards, a sales price tag, some twine, another tag, and her business card. So, cool. I like that it's a little sampling of everything. Um, so yeah, I'll let you know if I can make a folio. I'll end up doing a video. I don't know how soon it'll be, but that'll be a fun experiment to give a whirl and of course like I said I'll be making a traveler's notebook out of the pieces that um some other lovely ladies would love and cherish more than I do so yeah I'm really excited I think this is a good bang for your buck the kit was 40 bucks um obviously if you live internationally and have to pay a buttload and shipping it might not be a good deal for you um, but I think it's a really cool thing, um, and I'm excited to see what she does next. So I'll leave her channel and Etsy linked below, so if you want to get one for yourself, you can. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe so you don't miss any of my future videos, and I will catch you guys in my next one. Take care, guys. Bye.